Welcome to the 2020 Arts and Culture Awards presented by Arts Missoula. I'm Tom Benson, the Executive Director of Arts Missoula. Due to COVID-19, we are recognizing this year's award winners with a brief video, and we plan to honor each one in person at next year's Arts and Culture Awards to be held in April of 2021. Each year, Arts Missoula honors individuals and businesses that have made significant contributions to the Missoula's arts and cultural landscape. Awardees are nominated by community members and selected by the Arts Missoula Board of Directors. With this video, we present the Arts Educator Award for 2020. This award honors an outstanding educator at any level who has devoted a career to teaching a craft and making a significant impact on this community. I'm happy to present this award to John Combs, longtime music teacher, band director, and most recently, fine arts supervisor for Missoula County Public Schools. John grew up in Miles City and received his undergraduate degree from the University of Montana and his graduate degree from the University of Southern California, where he was named the USC Outstanding Graduate Student in Music Education. As the director of bands at Hellgate High School, he was known for his enthusiasm and professionalism, always helping students to achieve their full potential. His bands performed locally, regionally, and nationally, consistently receiving top ratings in festivals and competitions. Many of his students were selected for regional honors. His bands attended numerous Tournament of Roses, Fiesta Bowl, and Holiday Bowl parades. As fine arts supervisor for Missoula County Public Schools, John was instrumental in bringing the Kennedy Center's Any Given Child initiative to Missoula. Renamed Spark Arts Ignite Learning, this collaboration of teachers, artists, organizations, university professors, and philanthropists continues to impact hundreds of classrooms and thousands of Missoula students annually. Spark has integrated arts into the core curriculum, providing arts experiences for every K-8 student. John is a founding member of Missoula's Ed Norton Big Band and has been honored by the John Philip Sousa Foundation, the Montana Music Educators Association, and the National Association for Music Education. But he is most, most proud of his family. Missoula has been fortunate to have John Combs as a member of our community for 40 years. He's a true educator, a great friend and mentor, and a visionary leader in our public school system. Hi, I'm John Combs. I want to thank Tom Benson and the Arts Missoula Board for presenting me with this year's Arts Educator Award for 2020. I grew up in Miles City, Montana, cow capital of the world and home of the world-renowned bucking horse sale. The radio station call letters in Miles City are K-A-T-L, cattle. Growing up, that radio station would play both kinds of music, country and Western. But every evening of my young life, from six to 6.30, they would program Candlelight and Silver, one half hour of classical music for your dining enjoyment. Beethoven, Bach, Mozart, Brahms. But it was exactly one half hour it didn't matter if Beethoven had only a couple more phrases to go before the end of the symphony, the wrecking needle would rip off the LP and the hog prices were rolling. Miraculously, it was there that I came under the influence of two amazing men. One was my junior high school band director and the other was my high school band director. In a world of rough, tough cowboys and a sports-centric culture, it was tough being a small boy, especially someone who was better playing clarinet than shooting a ball. The band room became my second home, and these two men taught me early on about dedication and excellence. From there, I came to the University of Montana in Missoula, where the U of M honed some skills, and I stepped into the world of music education. I discovered that as much as kids enjoyed playing music and the camaraderie that music developed, they were in greater need of finding out who they needed to be. Thus, my teaching developed into training young people into developing character and excellence through the art of music. 
chip. You know, the little device that tells your computer, your phone, your car, and dozens of other electronic devices these days how it is supposed to function. CHIP became the acronym used to help young people see themselves in relation to their world. It stands for courage, humility, integrity, and positivity. Each an attribute of character that is needed to develop excellence in our classroom and life. Music was a fantastic teacher. It's full of truth. You're either in tune or you're not. You're either in time or you're not. You either play with a beautiful tone at the right volume or it's developing. The eventual product when one demonstrates great courage, humility, integrity, and positivity is excellence. And it's not excellence by yourself. It's something we do as an ensemble, as a community of musicians. We're not in this alone. What we do affects other people. We need to develop our chip for ourselves and each other. What choices are you making today that will create habits that you want to carry into the future? I said a thousand times. And I want to thank thousands of students who wound up teaching me more about courage, humility, integrity, and positivity than I ever taught them. I want to thank Missoula County Public Schools for giving a brash 25-year-old the chance to learn about teaching. Again, I had amazing mentors to work with. I also thank MCPS for the opportunity to wear the administrator label for these past 11 years. That is a whole nother set of skills and learning of which I have just scratched the surface. I also appreciate our visual arts and theater staff who patiently help me see and appreciate their artistic craft. Thanks to the Kennedy Center and their belief that Missoula, Montana could successfully carry out their Any Given Child initiative of bringing the arts to all of our MCPS kids. It has been so fun to partner with them to create Spark Arts Ignites Learning. From that experience, I really had a chance to get to know the depth and breadth of the Missoula arts community and its wonderful people. And thanks also to my family, my three daughters, who became the products of Missoula's rich environment for kids. Three very different young women who were each able to enjoy a varied but well-rounded experience in education. At one point, they too were my band students and helped me become a better teacher. Finally, my beautiful bride, Bobby. We've shared 36 years of Missoula life and I couldn't ask for a better partner for encouragement, support, and truthfulness. I'm humbled to share this award with so many amazing Missoulians this year as well as the list of previous award winners. It's such an honor to be on any list with them. Thank you, Arts Missoula, for connecting art, culture, and community through education, advocacy, and celebration. May God bless you all.